boys are here, the boys to entertain you. With music and laughter to help you on your way. So raising the rafters with a hey, hey, hey. With songs and sketches and jokes old and new. With us about, you won't feel blue. So meet the gang, cause the boys are here, the boys to entertain you. B O B O Y S, boys to entertain you. Shut up straight when you're punkering. And you, stop your damn wailing. And make room for me to park my backside. I have to wait here to carry these most important bags for Colonel Sahab. What you're doing, huh? I'm making chapati for my dinner. Hmm? My friend, you don't mind my telling you. But you're hitting your chapati much too hard. It will be tough, like the rubber tire of Colonel's GP. Randy, <laughs> go and tell to your grandmother how to suck the eggs. Here, try. To be thrown a layer. Isn't that beautiful? Well, it is certainly different. <laughs> now I am understanding why you have such fine teeth. Uh, what are you doing with the uh, Colonel's bags? I am putting them in GP. Because Colonel Saab and Captain Saab are going to Bombay, where they are going to stay in beautiful Taj Mahal Hotel. And when they get there, they are going to be drinking the cocktail. They drink the cocktails? Oh, yes. <laughs> this is very holy ceremony among British officer Saabs. And they are slapping each other on back. And they are chanting. Skin of your nose, mud in your eye, your bottoms up. Then they drink the cocktails. Huh? Then they drink the cocktail. Then one very important shouting man is hitting table with hammer. And he is saying, my lord, lady, gentleman, we are standing. And they are all upstanding together. Om Namah Shivaya Parinam. Oh, dearie me, here come the trouble. Oh, that is not trouble, you ignorant coolie. That is Sadhu. He is holy man. He has come to do prayers and to make blessing. Arre, nahi, nahi, gripo ki jebe khali karne ke liye. Bagal mein churi mo mein ram ram. Goody goody gum drops. Ram tera bala kare, beta. Oh, dearie me, he is wanting the lali. Do you think we should be giving him any? Oh, yes, my friend, we must, we must, in case he curses us. This is what we British call the insurance policy. <laughs> you know, I was bearer to Saab once who was cursed. And he was very sicky. And he could not attend the cocktail drinking party. And what is worse, for two months he could not be upstanding. <laughs> What do you do now, Rangi? Now he is making holy place. Shut up! <laughs> He's going now, Rangi. Ah, yes, he is going now. But he will come back because he has made holy place. Have you any idea who's coming to this party, sir? Well, the usual crowd. One or two fillies from Government House. Oh, and Emily Crichton Dunhower. Emily Crichton Dunn Howard? Yes, do you know her? Yes. She came out at the same time as my wife. Really? Yes. I met her at Lavinia Scott Montefiore's dance. Did you? Yes. <laughs> She's a real goer. Who? Lavinia Scott Montefiore? No, Emily Crichton Dunn Howard. Ah. We, uh, we had a bit of a thing. You didn't. We both took our meringues into the conservatory. Miss <laughs> Emily Sarbert, bum it, son of a. Get out. Excuse me, sir. I do not wish to interrupt anything important. But it has come to my attention, sir, that Bombardier Solomons and Gunner Bowman is actually a scheme which I think you should nip in a bud before you go, sir. And with your permission, I'd like to wheel them in. All right, Sergeant Major, but remember, we haven't got a lot of time. Sir. Right, good and daisy. Ciao! <laughs> Left hand! Quick mark! Left hand! Chef, stand at ease. Now, what's it all about? Oh, well, sir, it's like this. Uh, Gunner Bowman. They are going to give a show, sir. Charge for hat mission and put the money in your own pockets. 
And now, sir, you have heard it out of their own mouth. <laughs> Uh, well, sir, it's not quite like that. We was going to use the money to buy things to improve the show. I need a, a Carmen Miranda hat. Uh, the fruit's gone bad. <laughs> yes, irregular, sir, sir. And entirely against it, we'll stand in orders. There's no checking they won't spend it on egg banjos. All right, well, I'll look into this one and let you have my decision later. Thank you very much, sir. Show right me a quick march! <laughs> Sorry, Major. I think we can make an exception in this case, you know. Not for discipline, sir. There's no telling where it would end. You let one of them do it, they'll all want to do it. I've made my decision. They can give a show, and whatever money they make, can go toward improving the costumes and things. Mm, begging your pardon, sir, I think we're making a big mistake. Well, it's an order. Excuse me, Colonel Saab. Get out. <laughs> what do you want, Vera? Sir, Major Saab, Colonel Saab's Jeepy Larry is waiting. Get out. Right, we must go. You know, I think you've rather got your knife into the concert party, son, Oh, not at all, sir. I just don't like pandering to a lot of puffs. <laughs> well, be that as it may, I don't want to hear that you've prevented them from performing their show, all right? Sir. Understand? I understand, sir. And I shall make known you a decision. La, 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 la. Oh, stand up straight when you were pandering. <laughs> Mommy <Mother laughs> Solomon! Get your dirty shower on, put it up, get at the double! Excuse me, Sergeant Major. Do you really need me? I've just put my hair in curlers. <laughs> Get on, Parade! Turn us again. Squad show! Now, my lovely boys. <laughs> As you know, the Colonel, for some reason, what is beyond my imagination, thinks very highly of you. So, we have decided that I will not stop you putting on you a concert tomorrow night. Oh, thank you very much, Sergeant Major. You're a real brick. However, at the precise hour when you intend giving you a concert, I intend giving a moonlight parade for the old camp. So, lovely boys, you can have your show, but the one thing you cannot have is a audience. <laughs> <laughs> That's hardly fair, Sergeant Major. Well, that's hardly fair, Sergeant Major. <laughs> now, doubtless you are all disappointed at not being on this moonlight parade. Especially Lady Beaumont. <laughs> are you disappointed? Heartbroken. I thought as much. So, you can all have your moonlight parade right here in the sunlight. Them stones, what says Royal Artillery Depot, is too big, so you can break them up into more artistic pieces. And then, you can put them... What is this dirty mess on my parade ground? Tell me, Mr. Sam, this is not dirty mess, this is holy man. I will not have dirty holy men making a mess on my parade ground! Get him off! Tell me, Mr. Sam, do not say that, because he will hear you. You might also feel my boot. Jow, jowdy, jowdy, jow! Excuse me, Sergeant Major, but, but you shouldn't interfere with their religion. That's how the Indian mutiny started. That's how the Indian mutiny started. <laughs> All right, Mr. Lardy Gunner Graham. My pig and boot will not touch his religious backside. You and get a Macintosh can carry him. Relevantly away. Move his head, move his head! Shoo. Pick him up, pick him up, pick him up! Quack, quack! Left wheel! <laughs> Holy <laughs> oh, he may be, but you are this. There is nothing more holy to this man's army than the parade ground on which we are standing right now. It is sacred, and as long as this crown is on my wrist, it will remain unsilaged by dirty foreign feet. It's <laughs> all <laughs> the same two men! Pick him up, pick him up! Get him right off this camp! Move yourself, move yourself! <laughs> I therefore removed the aforementioned offensive holy man and caused him to be placed outside WD property. Blimey. Is it Bond's back? Here, Landy. You better tell the sergeant major. Sir, I tell him pretty damn quick. <laughs> Excuse me, Sergeant Major, sir. Shut up. What do you want, Bella? Sergeant Major, sir. Dirty mess is back on parade time. <laughs> what? And Sergeant Major Saab, I think he has come to stay. What do you mean? 
He has brought his bed. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, Daddy, then get off my parade! Joe, Daddy! He can't hear you, Sergeant Major. He's in a trance. Yes, you, you, you see, Sergeant Major Sab, he is saying his prayers. Then he will go to bed. <laughs> Going to bed, is he? I'll soon settle his ash. <laughs> You must not do that. I am not hurting him. I'm just making him more comfortable. <laughs> oh, Sergeant Major, I think you've upset him. Hello, Kinios of Pardega! Sergeant Major Sahab, he's cursing you. He says your own child boy will be like bed of nails. Tell him to get stuffed. <laughs> Very difficult to translate, sir. Sari zindagi wo kiliyo tujhe sone nahi degi. Sergeant Major Sahab, he said that never again you have good sleep, and all night you be pricked by nails. Tell him to get nodded. That is even more difficult to translate, sir. Main to ja raha hoon. Sergeant Major Sahab, he says he is going. Magar mera atma to yehi rahega. Sergeant Major Sahab, he says that he is going, but he is going to leave his spirit in that place, and it will be plague to you, Sergeant Major Sahab, and also dirty, big, damn nuisance. <laughs> well, you've all had a nice rest, haven't you? Get on with your work! My is <laughs> making eyes at me. Look at my hands. <laughs> Callous they are. Callous. Who ever heard of Ginger Rogers with calloused hands? <laughs> I'd like to get my hands on Sergeant Major Sharp's throat. Yeah. Fancy him holding a special parade so we can't get an audience. Yeah. I wish that curse would come true. Oh, Nori, that'd be daft. But, Sab, the curse of the Sadhu is very strong. Yes. Perhaps... Perhaps we could exploit it in some way. What do you mean? Well, so he thinks it's coming true. Somebody could get under his bed and stick pins in it. <laughs> but I know one very naughty man in the bazaar who make the itching powder. Itching powder? Yes, sir. He make it from chilies, the whiskers of the mouse, and some very hard short hairs from certain part of water buffalo. <laughs> Randy, you're a genius. Oh, sir, you are most kind and quite right. <laughs> hey, Moo Masoor Ki Dal, show Makkar, big head. <laughs> Go back and pull your punker. <laughs> Randy, Randy, get down the bazaar and get some egg down, Malum. Well, sir. We've got to get that powder in the Sergeant Major's charpoy before he gets his head down this afternoon. <laughs> Jun Jun Parali, Ankama Kadali, Ankama Kadali, Ichiku, Ichiku. Bella, what is you doing here? Sergeant Major Saab, I'm just making your chapoy all smooth and silky, so you can have dirty big kip, isn't it? If he wants a job, get them boots polished. Acha Saab. No nails in air, Bella, eh? <laughs> no nails, Sergeant Major Saab. <laughs> Not looking, Sam, just cleaning booties. Do that outside, because I am going to have 40 winks. Just that. Sergeant Major Sahab, you are so brave. Most people who have been cursed just go away and, and die. <laughs> That's the trouble of the Holy Indians. No control. There's one thing you learn in a British army. is control. <laughs> control not working, Sahab? Shut up! <laughs> It was 
a good try. It just didn't come off. Maybe Randy didn't put enough powder in the bed. Oh, come on, he put it in the old packet. He's so thick-skinned, he probably didn't even notice. <laughs> well, Randy said he was squirming like he was in the frying pan. He just wouldn't give way. You've got to add it to the sergeant, Major. He's a man of iron. Maybe we'll think of something else tomorrow. Yeah. Maybe. Well, good night, fellas. Right. Sleep well. Night, Sally. Turn the light out, Lofty. I'm asleep. <laughs> right, dear, what's that? Open this hub! Open this hub! Sergeant Major, shut up, Sab is not shut up any longer, Sab. Come on, fellas. Come, come quickly, come quickly. <laughs> quickly. <laughs> quickly. <laughs> 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 He's always been rotten, now he looks it. <laughs> Sam, he's very sicky. Maybe we should send for the M.O. Right. Nobby, yeah. go get the M.O. Tell him it's urgent. Right, oh, sorry. But, Sam, you should send for the holy man. Oh. He's waking up. <sighs> Where am I? <laughs> we, we was worried about you, Sergeant Major. <sighs> worried about me? Whatever... F <laughs> 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 Tell you the truth, I have had a bit of a bad night, you know, but it's nothing to be concerned about. You go back to sleep, lovely boys. <laughs> this seems all right. We'll tell the MO not to bother. No, oh, I'm not bothering you! Oh, <laughs> right, squatch him! Turn the dice! Squatch him! Right. <laughs> On a command move, you will attack all holy men who are sticking nails into your sergeant major. <laughs> 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 What shall we do? <laughs> we better humour him, I suppose. Come, Come on, boys, give it to him. Yeah, give it to him. <laughs> <laughs> They're gone. Sergeant Major, can we go back to bed now, please? Yes. It's all right now. You can go. Oh. Come on, fellas. Come! Okay. One man stay here in case he comes back. And a Parkins. Yes, sir? Come here. Yes, sir. <laughs> Stay with me, son. You look after your old sergeant major. Yes, sir. Climb upon my knee, sonny boy. <laughs> I'm talking to you, sonny boy. There's no way of knowing. Do something, Solly. Pay attention, gunner. There's no way of knowing. He really has no gone bonkers. He's obviously got a very high temperature and it sent him delirious. Scotty boy. <laughs> Can I have that? Right! Falling towards back. Move yourself, move yourself! Right. And if you see one of them slant eyed sons of heaven carrying a sharp nail, <laughs> let him have it. Follow me, boys. <laughs> 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 Keep your wits about you, boys. <laughs> Who is watching the rear? Me, Sergeant Major. Watch carefully, gonna sub them, won't you? I will, Sergeant Major. Good boy. Don't touch the holy man. He might get cross. <laughs> you better step over him, fellas. Psst, sorry, sorry. He's here. That must not the but MO. No, you see, he's gone to a cocktail party with the CO. This is the orderly. Blimey, what can he do for us? I have sleeping tablets. Oh, I ain't feeding him sleeping tablets the way he's acting. He left me fingers off. Ah, I have hypodermic syringe. Well, I don't fancy sticking that thing in him either. <laughs> <laughs> He'll think it's another nail. Look, come on, screw up on him. Oh, dearie me. Sergeant Major Saab is going to get the needle. <laughs> that loaded. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. But keep the safety catch on. <laughs> ah! oh, Blimey, he's up again. We've got to stop him, Solid, before he gets out of the car. Come on. Let's get his knee into him. Now, what's he up to, Tom? Huh? 
Here's Monkey Man. This is very bad. But if you ask me, he's just reversing the type. Oh, dear. <laughs> Come on, boy. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, we're going to get him down. <laughs> so, they like very much the banana. <laughs> Here, Sergeant Major. Nice bananas. Lovely, fresh bananas. Get your nice bananas. Oh, it's atlas. You want him to eat it, not buy it. <laughs> Come on, son. Come on. That's it. Then you get nice bananas. Good boy. Nice, fresh bananas. <laughs> there, there you go. <laughs> there you are. Nice, easy now. Get him lower. Lower. <laughs> nice bananas, son. Nice, easy, easy boy. Oh, son, it's up. A little more to the left. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Devil orders clearly state that bombardiers will not stick needles into the sergeant majors. Into the sergeant majors. <laughs> Bam. He's still got a heebie jeebies. Oh, I think we've gone too far. It's perfectly simple. The itching powder gave a physical manifestation to an auto-suggestive precondition created by the holy man. The result is a suspension of the normal non-emotive mental criteria. You mean he's gone bonkers? <laughs> Precisely. <laughs> yes, sir. Randy, did you find the holy man? Yes, sir. I found him. Yeah. And he said he will not be able to take away curse from Sergeant Major Saab unless he get 200 rupees. 200 rupees? <laughs> yes, sir. For organ fund. Blimey, it wouldn't cost that a Westminster Abbey. This is different organ funds up. Well, he ain't getting 200 and that's final. <laughs> so, then I find two other holy men, sir. And they say they will not take away curse because this holy man, not holy man at all, but very naughty, double-crossing pony who could not make proper curse to save his own bacon, isn't it? <laughs> you mean he wasn't kosher? He wasn't cursed at all? That is correct, sir. We've got to tell the Sergeant Major. No, 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 no. It won't, won't make any difference. That's it's all in the mind, you see. He thinks he's being cursed by a holy man. Well, he's got to be decursed by one. Well, can't any of the holy men uh, pretend to take off the curse? Oh, yes, sir. For 300 rupees. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's it, fellas. We've got to find ourselves a holy man. So I'm telling them, to make their skin brown, they should be using walnut juice. Because that is what doing according to Mr. Rudyard Kipling who is a very clever writing man. But no, they want all my old tea leaves. It is not right, I'm telling you. No, I think they should use them to use the gaika paws and cherry blossom. Don't be dicky clever. <laughs> oh, handsome, real handsome. And so, all you want now is just a little sprinkling of the cow dung. No! No! I draw the line. I draw the line, Sully. <laughs> I don't believe in holy men. There's nothing the matter with me. It's just a touch of flu and a bit of dobie it's thrown in, that's all. Well, maybe the holy man can cure that and all. Ah, it's, it's worth a try. Right, bring it over here, where the holy man lay. Come on. Sully. Sully, what are you up to? Look, Gloria, all you have to do is lie on here. <laughs> I'm not lying on that. What's the matter? It's just a conjuring trick. Yes, you see, the secret is that the nails are very close together. Yeah. This means that the weight is evenly distributed, so it's more or less the same as a flat surface. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, bang goes that theory. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry? No, 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 no. Excuse me, sir. I have one most excellent wheeze. We could put something very strong down Bowman Saab's dirt, which will prevent the nails from being clicky. Good idea, Randy. Find something. At your house. Hey, Mohammed! I will accept your kind offer of one chapati. You are most welcome. <laughs> Excuse me, Bowman Saab, while I put one chapati down your backside. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Oh, oh! Oh! Ah! Oh! <laughs> Quick, sit down. 
Keep your shoulders back, boy. Sergeant Major, Sergeant Major, come and sit over here. Oh. Come on. You're very good doing this for me. There you go. I made a wacky typhoon lap song. Sergeant Major Tom, Gus is now going from you to Holy Man, and you must chant as he does. Awa! Awa! Tana! Tana! Saya! Saya! Just gotta do it again. Awa! Tana! Saya! You gotta do it a little bit faster. Awa! Tana! Saya! Awa! Tana! Saya! Awa! Tana! Saya! Oh, what a nice I am. Parky, make the sacred oh, mark. Sacred mark coming up. Curse <laughs> 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 is now gone from you to Holy Man. And one more thing, Sergeant Major. You must not go out in the moonlight for at least a month. So you have to cancel that moonlight parade. It is cancelled. Right, you're cured. <laughs> I'm feeling better. Oh, congratulations, Sergeant Major. We were getting quite worried about you, Sergeant Major. <laughs> well, I'm seeing clearly for the first time for hours. <laughs> Joe! <laughs> Get that dirty mess on my parade road, fall into me! I'm moving, John and Joe! Start on over again. Oh, I'm just yes, up. I'm sorry, sir, but I cannot get it all off. He spent two hours scrubbing at me and he won't come off. Yes, sir, I've even taken him to Dobewala, and he said he would not come clean unless he bashed him against rock. <laughs> I'm sorry, Gloria. So what, Solly? I suppose I'll get used to being an Indian after a while. <laughs> oh, come on, you better turn in. Yeah, I was good though, wasn't I? With all that wailing and all that. You know, when I go into a role, you know, I really get into it, I give it a lot of integrity. Yeah. Oh, Saab, you a double, Sadhu. <laughs> yeah. You know, it's funny how the mind can play funny tricks, isn't it? I mean, he thought he was cursed, and so he was. Funny, that. Well, good night, sunshine. Yeah. Night, night. Good night, Randy. Night, night, Saab. Sleepy tighty. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh, Saab, do not play the joke. I'm not playing the joke. Sorry, feel that. What? Nothing there. You sure? Of course I'm sure. Come on, get some sleep. That way. <laughs> night, night. Good night, sweetheart. No! In the rear. <laughs> Watch carefully, gonna sub them, won't you? I will, Sergeant Major. Good boy. Come on. <laughs> Don't 
catch the holy man, he might get cross. <laughs> you better step over him, fellas. Mo? Oh, you see, he's gone to a cocktail party with the seal. This is the orderly. Blimey, what can he do for us? I have sleeping tablets. Oh, I ain't feeding him in sleeping tablets the way he's acting. He left me fingers off. Ah, I have hypodermic syringe. Well, I don't fancy sticking that thing in him either. <laughs> no, no, he'll think it's another nail. Look, come on, scrape up on him. Oh, dearie me. No, every Crichton done hard. Ah. <laughs> we, uh, we had a bit of a thing. You didn't. We both took our meringues into the conservatory. Miss Henry, this but bum with your son of a Get out. Excuse me, sir. I do not wish to interrupt anything important. But it has come to my attention, sir, that Bombardier Solomon's and Gunner Bowman is actually a scheme which I think you should nip in a bud before you go, sir. And with your permission, I'd like to wheel them in. All right, Sergeant Major, but remember, we haven't got a lot of time. Sir. Right, good, and Daisy. Show! <laughs> left hand! Quick mark! Left hand, left hand, left hand, left hand, right wing on! Left hand, right wing on! Right, Jeff, stand at ease. Now, what's it all about? Oh, well, sir, it's like this. Uh, gonna they are going to gonna give them. a show, sir. Charge for hat mission and put the money in their own pockets. And now, sir, you have heard it out of their own mouth. <laughs> Well, sir, it's not quite like that. We was going to use the money to buy things to improve the show. I need a, a Carmen Miranda hat. Uh, the fruit's gone bad. <laughs> this irregular, sir, and entirely against debt will stand in orders. There's no checking they won't spend it on egg banjos. All right, well, I'll look into this one and let you have my decision later. Thank you very much, sir. Show! Right, real quick, March! <laughs> Emily Crichton Dunn Howard? Yes, do you know her? Yes. She came out at the same time as my wife. Really? Yes. I met her at Lavinia Scott Montefiore's dance. Did you? Yes. <laughs> She's a real goer. Who? Lavinia Scott Montefiore? No, Ebony Crichton done hard. Ah. <laughs> we, uh, we had a bit of a thing. You didn't. We both took our meringues into the conservatory. Miss Henry, this but bum with your son of a Get out. Excuse me, sir. I do not wish to interrupt anything important. But it has come to my attention, sir, that Bombardier Solomon's and Gunner Bowman is actually a scheme which I think you should nip in a bud before you go, sir. And with your permission, I'd like to wheel them in. All right, Sergeant Major, but remember, we haven't got a lot of time. Sir. Right, good, and Daisy. Show! <laughs> left hand! Quick mark! Left hand, left hand, left hand, left hand, right wing on! Jeff, stand at ease. Now, what's it all about? Oh, well, sir, it's like this. Uh, Gunner Bowman... They are going to gonna give a show, sir. Charge for hat mission and put the money in their own pockets. And now, sir, you have heard it out of their own mouth. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, sir, it's not quite like that. We was going to use the money to buy things to improve the show. I need a, a Carmen Miranda hat. Uh, the fruit's gone bad. <laughs> it's because of the mouse and some very hard short hairs from certain part of Water Buffalo. <laughs> Randy, you're a genius. Oh, Sab, you are most kind and quite right. Hey, Mum Surkidan, show Matkar, big head. Go back and pull your punker. Randy, Randy, get down the bazaar and get some egg down, Malum. Well, sir. We've got to get that powder in the Sergeant Major's charpoy before he gets his head down this afternoon. <laughs> Bella, what is you doing here? Sergeant Major Saab, I'm just making your charpoy all smooth and silky so you could have dirty big kip, isn't it? If he wants a job, get them boots polished. Sergeant Major Saab. No nails in air, Bella, eh? <laughs> no nails, Sergeant Major Saab. <laughs> 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 no, 
not looking, so I'm just cleaning booties. Do that outside, because I am going to have 40 winks. Just that. <sighs> Come on, boy. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, we're going to get him down. So, they like very much the banana. Oh. Yes, sir, Major. Nice bananas. Lovely, fresh bananas. Get your nice bananas. Uh, yeah. Atlas, you want him to eat it, not buy it. <laughs> Come on, son. Come on. That's it. Then you get nice bananas. Good boy. Nice, fresh bananas. <laughs> there you go. There you are. Nice, easy, nice. Get him going. Nice bananas, son. Nice, easy, easy, boy. Oh, son, it's up. A little more to the left. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Devil waters clearly state that bombardiers will not stick needles into the sergeant majors. Into the sergeant majors. <laughs> Bam. He's still got a heebie jeebies. Oh, I think we've gone too far. <laughs> it's perfectly simple. The itching powder gave a physical manifestation to an auto-suggestive precondition created by the holy man. The result is a suspension of the normal non-emotive mental criteria. <laughs> Let's go! Pick him up, pick him up, pick him up! Hot, hot, left wheel! 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 Left All ye may be, but you are this. There is nothing more ory to this man's army than the parade ground on which we are standing right now. It is sacred, and as long as this crown is on my wrist, it will remain unsilaged by dirty foreign feet. It's <laughs> <laughs> the same two men! Pick him up, pick him up! Get him right off his camp! Move yourself, move yourself! <laughs> <laughs> I therefore removed the aforementioned offensive ory man, and caused him to be placed outside WD property. Blimey. Is it Bond's back? Here, landing. You better tell the sergeant major. Sir, I tell him pretty damn quick. Excuse me, sergeant major, sir. Shut up. What do you want, brother? Sergeant major, sir. Dirty mess is back on parade, sir. <laughs> what? And sergeant major, sir. I think he has come to stay. What do you mean? He has brought his bed. <laughs> what? <laughs> you daddy, then get off my parade You daddy! Worried about me? Whatever f- ah! oh! <laughs> Tell you the truth, I have had a bit of a bad night, you know, but it's nothing to be concerned about. You go back to sleep, lovely boys. This seems all right. We'll tell the MO not to bother. No, I don't want to leave you alone. Right. Squatch him. Take the dice. Squatch him. Right. On a command move, you will attack all holy men who are sticking nails into your sergeant major. <laughs> 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 What shall we do? <laughs> we better humour him, I suppose. Come, Come on, boys, give it to him! Yeah, him. <laughs> <laughs> oh. They're gone. Sergeant Major, can we go back to bed now, please? Yes. It's all right now. You can go. Oh. Come on, fellas. Come! Huh? One man stay here in case they comes back. In the parkings. Yes, sir? Come here. Yes, sir. <laughs> Stay with me, son. You look after your old sergeant major. Yes, sir. Climb upon my knee, sonny boy. <laughs> I'm talking to you, sonny boy. There's no. Precisely. <laughs> yes, sir. Randy, did you find the holy man? Yes, sir. I find him. Yeah. And he said he will not be able to take away curse from Sergeant Major Saab unless he get 200 rupees. 200 rupees? Yes, sir. For organ fund. Blimey, it wouldn't cost that a Westminster Abbey. 
This is different, Argen van Zal. Well, he ain't getting 200, and that's final. <laughs> so, then I find two other holy men, sir. And they say they will not take away curse because this holy man, not holy man at all, but very naughty, double-crossing pony who could not make proper curse to save his own bacon, isn't it? <laughs> you mean he wasn't kosher? He wasn't cursed at all? That is correct, sir. We've got to tell the sergeant major. No, 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 no. It won't, won't make any difference. That's it's all in the mind, you see. He thinks he's been cursed by a holy man. Well, he's got to be decursed by one. Well, can't any of the holy men uh, pretend to take off the curse? Oh, yes, sir. For 300 rupees. <laughs> well, that's it, fellas. We've got to find ourselves a holy man. So I'm telling them, to make their skin brown, they should be using walnut juice. Because that is what doing according to Mr. Rudyard Kipling who is a very clever writing man. But no, they want all my old tea leaves. It is not right, I am telling you. No, I think they should use them as a gaiga pot or cherry blossom. Don't be dicky clever. Well, fellas, it was a good try. It just didn't come off. Maybe Randy didn't put enough pearl on the bed. Oh, come on, he put it in the old packet. He's so thick-skinned, he probably didn't even notice. <laughs> well, Randy said he was squirming like he was in the frying pan. He just wouldn't give way. You've got to add it to the sergeant, Major. He's a man of iron. Maybe we'll think of something else tomorrow. Yeah. Maybe. Well, good night, fellas. Right. Sleep well. Night, Dully. Turn the light out, Lofty. I'm asleep. <laughs> right, dear, what's that? Open your sub! Open your sub! Sergeant Major, shut up, sub is not shut up any longer, sub! Come on, fellas! Come quickly! Come quickly! Quickly! Oh! 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 Blimey, he looks rotten! He's always been rotten, now he looks it! Sub, he's very sicky! Maybe we should send for the M.O. Right. Nobby, yeah. go get the ammo. Tell him it's urgent. Right, oh, sorry. But, Saab, you should send for the holy man. Oh. He's waking up. <sighs> Where am I? <laughs> we, we was worried about you, Sergeant Major. <sighs> worried about me? Whatever. F <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh! To tell you the truth, I have had a bit of a bad night, you know, but it's nothing to be concerned about. You go back to sleep, lovely boys. <laughs> this seems all right. We'll tell the M.O. not to bother. No, I don't want to be Right. Squatch him! Get the dice! Squatch him! Right. <laughs> Want to come on, move? You will attack all holy men who are sticking nails into your sergeant major. <laughs> 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 What shall we do? <laughs> we better humour him, I suppose. Come, Come on, on, boys, give it to him! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> They're gone. Sergeant Major, can we go back to bed now, please? Yes. It's all right now. You can go. Oh. Come on, fellas. Come! Huh? One man stay here in case they comes back. And the parkings. Yes, sir? Come here. Yes, sir. <laughs> Stay with me, son. You'll look after your old sergeant major. Yes, sir. Climb upon my knee, sonny boy. <laughs> I'm talking to you, sonny boy. There's no way of knowing. Do something, Solly. Pay attention, Gunner. There's no way of knowing. He really has gone bonkers. He's obviously got a very high temp. And a Parkins. Yes, sir. Come here. Yes, sir. <laughs> Stay with me, son. You look after your old sergeant major. Yes, sir. Climb upon my knee, sonny boy. <laughs> I'm talking to you, sonny boy. There's no way of knowing. Do something, Solly. Pay attention, gunner. There's no way of knowing. He really has gone bonkers. Going. He's obviously got a very high temperature and it sent him delirious. Funny boy. <laughs> Get back! Right! Pauline comes back! He moves himself! Right. And if 
you sees one of them slant-eyed sons of heaven carrying a sharp nail, <laughs> let him have it. Follow me, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Keep your wits about you, boys. <laughs> Who is watching the rear? Me, Sergeant Major. Watch carefully, gonna sub them, won't you? I will, Sergeant Major. Good boy. Don't touch the holy man. He might get cross. <laughs> you better step over him, fellas. Sully, <laughs> Sully, he's here. That must not But M.O. No, you see, he's gone to a cocktail party with the CEO. This is the orderly. Blimey, what can he do for us? I have sleeping tablets. Oh, I ain't feeding him sleeping tablets the way he's acting. He'll have my fingers off. Ah, I have hypodermic syringe. Well, I don't fancy sticking that thing in him either. <laughs> no, no, he'll think it's another nail. Look, come on, scrape up on him. Oh, dearie me, Sergeant Major Saab is going to get the neat. <laughs> that loaded. Good boy, good boy. But keep the safety catch on. <laughs> ah! oh, Blimey, well, he's up again. We've got to stop him, Sully, before he gets out of the car. Monkey man, this is very bad. But if you ask me, he's just a verse of the type. Oh, dear. Please, <laughs> <laughs> Major. Watch carefully, gonna sub them, won't you? I will, Sergeant Major. Good boy. Come on. <laughs> Don't touch the holy man. He might get cross. <laughs> You better step over him, fellas. <laughs> Sully, Sully, he's here. That must not the... But M.O.? No, you see, he's gone to a cocktail party with the CEO. This is the orderly. Blimey, what can he do for us? I have sleeping tablets. Oh, I ain't feeding him sleeping tablets the way he's acting. He'll have my fingers off. Ah, I have hypodermic syringe. <laughs> Well, I don't fancy sticking that thing in him either. <laughs> no, no, he'll think it's another nail. Look, come on, scrape up on him. Oh, dearie me. Sergeant Major Saab is going to get the neat. <laughs> that loaded. <laughs> good boy, good boy. But keep the safety catch on. <laughs> <laughs> no! Oh, Blimey, he's up again. We've got to stop him, Sully, before he gets out of the car. He's monkey man. This is very bad. <laughs> but if you ask me, he's just a verse of the type. Oh, dear. <laughs> Come on, boy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, we're going to get him down. <laughs> so, they like very much the banana. <laughs> Here, Sergeant Major. Nice bananas. Lovely, fresh bananas. Get your nice banana. Uh, uh, Atlas, you want him to eat it, not buy it. <laughs> Come on, son. Come on. That's it. Down you get. Nice bananas. Good boy. Nice, fresh bananas. <laughs> there, there you go. <laughs> there you are. Nice, easy now. Get him lower. Lower. Nice bananas, son. Nice, go. Easy, easy, boy. Son, it's up. A little more to the left. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Devil orders clearly state that bombardiers will not stick needles into the sergeant majors. Into the sergeant majors. 
He's still got a heebie-jeebies. Oh, I think we've gone too far. Best bananas. <laughs> so, there you go. There you are. Nice, easy man. Get him lower. Lower. Nice bananas, son. Nice, easy, easy boy. Look, son, it's up. A little more to the left. <laughs> Bombardier, what the hell are you doing? Clearly state that bombardiers will not stick needles into the sergeant majors. Into the sergeant majors. He's still got a heebie jeebies. Oh, oh, I think we've gone too far. It's perfectly simple. The itching powder gave a physical manifestation to an auto suggestive precondition created by the holy man. The result is a suspension of the normal non-emotive mental criteria. Yes. Let's go! Pick him up, pick him up, pick him up! Hup, hup! Left wheel! 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 Get back here, please! You have to double move yourself! Move yourself! All ye may be, but you are this. There is nothing more ori to this man's army than the parade ground on which we are standing right now. It is sacred, and as long as this crown is on my wrist, it will remain unsilaged by dirty foreign feet. Four in the same two men! Pick him up, pick him up! Get him right off his camp! Move yourself, move yourself! <laughs> I therefore removed the aforementioned offensive ori man and caused him to be placed outside W.D. Property. Blimey. Is it Bond's back? Here, yeah, landing. You better tell the sergeant major. Sir, I tell him pretty damn quick. Excuse me, sergeant major, sir. Shut up. What do you want, brother? Sergeant major, sir. Dirty mess is back on parade, sir. <laughs> what? And sergeant major, sir. I think he has come to stay. What do you mean? He has brought his bed. <laughs> what? <laughs> you daddy, then get off my parade Joe, daddy! Worried about me? Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> To tell you the truth, I have had a bit of a bad night, you know, but it's nothing to be concerned about. You go back to sleep, lovely boys. <laughs> this seems all right. We'll tell the M.O. not to bother. No, I'm not going to leave you alone! Right, squad champ! Get the dice! Squad champ! <laughs> I'm talking to you, sonny boy. There's no way of knowing. Do something, Solly. Pay attention, Gunner. There's no way of knowing. He really has gone bonkers. He's obviously got a very high temperature and it sent him delirious. Scotty boy. <laughs> They're coming back! Right! Falling close back! Move yourself! Move yourself! Right. And if you see one of them slant-eyed sons of heaven carrying a sharp nail, <laughs> let him have it. Follow me, boys. <laughs> 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 Keep your wits about you, boys. <laughs> Who is watching the rear? <laughs> Watch carefully, gonna sub them, won't you? I will, Sergeant Major. <laughs> Good boy. Touch the holy man. He might get cross. <laughs> you better step over him, fellas. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. He's here. That must not the MO. Oh, you see, he's gone to a cocktail party with the CEO. This is the orderly. 
Blimey, what can he do for us? I have sleeping tablets. Oh, I ain't feeding him in sleeping tablets the way he's acting. He'll have my fingers off. Ah, <laughs> I have hypodermic syringe. Well, I don't fancy sticking that thing in him either. <laughs> <laughs> He'll think it's another nail. Look, come on, screw up on him. Oh, dearie me. Sergeant Major Saab is going to get the needle. <laughs> that loaded. <laughs> Good boy. Good boy. But keep the safety catch on. <laughs> ah! oh, Blimey, he's up again. We've got to stop him, Solid, before he gets out of the car. He's monkey man. This is very bad. But if you ask me, he's just reversed the type. Oh dear. <laughs> Come on, boy. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, we're going to get him down. <laughs> so they like very much the banana. <laughs> Here, Sergeant Major. Nice bananas. Lovely friends. Bella, what is you doing here? Sergeant Major Saab, I'm just making your chapoy all smooth and silky, so you could have dirty big kip, isn't it? <laughs> if he wants a job, get them boots polished. Uh, just up. <coughs> no nails in air bearer, eh? <laughs> no <laughs> nails, Sergeant Major Saab. <laughs> Not looking, Saab, just cleaning booties. <laughs> Do that outside, because I am going to have 40 winks. Just up. <clears throat> Come on, boy. Uh, <laughs> oh, no, we're going to get him down. Saab, they like very much the banana. <laughs> Here, Sir Major. Nice bananas. Lovely, fresh bananas. Get your nice bananas. Uh, yeah. Atlas, you want him to eat it, not buy it. <laughs> Come on, son. Come on. That's it. Then you get nice bananas. Good boy. Nice, fresh bananas. <laughs> then, then you get them. <laughs> there you are. Nice, easy man. Get him going. Nice bananas, son. Nice, nice, easy. Easy, easy boy. Look, son, it's up. I need to move to the left. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> Devil Warner's clearly state that bombardiers will not stick needles into the sergeant majors. Into the sergeant majors. <laughs> Bam. He's still got a heebie jeebies. Oh, I think we've gone too far. <laughs> it's perfectly simple. The itching powder gave a physical manifestation to an auto-suggestive precondition created by the holy man. The result is a suspension of the normal non-emotive mental criteria. <laughs> pick him up, pick him up, pick him up! Hot, hot, hot. Left wheel! 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 Get back to place, you have to double move yourself, move yourself! All he may be, but you are this. There is nothing more ori to this man's army than the parade ground on which we are standing right now. It is sacred, and as long as this crown is on my wrist, it will remain unsilaged by dirty foreign feet. It's all in the same two men! Pick him up, pick him up! Get him right off his camp! Move yourself, move yourself! <laughs> I therefore removed the aforementioned offensive ori man and caused him to be placed outside. I did not wish to interrupt anything important. But it has come to my attention, sir, that Bombardier Solomons and Gunner Bowman is actually a scheme which I think you should nip in a bud before you go, sir. And with your permission, I'd like to wheel him in. All right, Sergeant Major, but remember, we haven't got a lot of time. Sir. Right, good and Daisy. Show! <laughs> Left hand! Quick march! Left hand, left hand! Jeff, stand at ease. Now, what's it all about? Oh, well, sir, it's like this. Uh, Gunner Bowman they are going to give a show, sir. Charge for hat mission and put the money in their own pockets. 
And now, sir, you have heard it out of their own mouth. <laughs> Well, sir, it's not quite like that. We was going to use the money to buy things to improve the show. I need a, a Carmen Miranda hat. Uh, the fruit's gone bad. It's because of the mouse and some very hard short hairs from certain part of Water Buffalo. <laughs> Randy, you're a genius. Oh, Sab, you are most kind and quite right. Hey, Mum, Surki, Dad. Show Matkar. Big head. Go back and pull your punk up. <laughs> Randy, Randy, get down the bazaar and get some egg down, Mallum. Well, sir. We've got to get that powder in the Sergeant Major's charpoy before he gets his head down this afternoon. What are you doing here? Sergeant Major Saab, I'm just making your charpoy all smooth and silky so you could have dirty big kip, isn't it? <laughs> if he wants a job, get them boots polished. Sergeant Major Saab. No nails in air bearer, eh? <laughs> no mm. nails, Sergeant Major Saab. <laughs> Not looking, Sam, just cleaning booties. <laughs> Do that outside, because I am going to have 40 winks. Just that. <clears throat> Come on, boy. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, we're going to get him down. <laughs> Sam, they like very much the banana. <laughs> Here, sir, Major. Nice bananas. Lovely, fresh bananas. Get your nice banana. Uh, yeah. Atlas, you want him to eat it, not buy it. <laughs> Come on, son. Come on. That's it. Then you get nice bananas. Good boy. Nice, fresh bananas. <laughs> then, then you get <laughs> There you are. Nice. Tell him to get nodded. <laughs> that is even more difficult to translate. My daughter home. That's where the sound he says he's going. Magarmira Athmato, you hear a hega? Sergeant Major Saab, he says that he is going, but he is going to leave his spirit in that place and it will be plague to you, Sergeant Major Saab, and also dirty big damn nuisance. <laughs> well, you've all had a nice rest, haven't you? Get on with your work! My <laughs> is making eyes at me. Look at my hands. <laughs> Calloused they are. Calloused. Who ever heard of Ginger Rogers with calloused hands? <laughs> I'd like to get my hands on Sergeant Major Sharp's throat. Yeah. Fancy him holding a special parade so we can't get an audience. Yeah. I wish that curse would come true. Oh, nor it. I'd be daft. But, Sab, the curse of the Sadhu is very strong. Yes. Perhaps... Perhaps we could exploit it in some way. What do you mean? Well, so he thinks it's coming true. Somebody could get under his bed and stick pins in it. <laughs> but I know one very naughty man in the bazaar who make the itching powder. Itching powder? Yes, sir. He make it from chilies, the whiskers of the mouse, and some very hard short hairs from certain part of water buffalo. <laughs> Randy, you're a genius. Oh, Saab, you are most kind and quite right. <laughs> hey, Mum, Surki, Dad. Show Matkar. Big head. <laughs> Go back and pull your punk up. <laughs> Randy, Randy, get down the bazaar and get some egg down, Mallum. Well, sir. We've got to get that powder in the Sergeant Major's charpoy before he gets his head down this afternoon. <laughs> Bella, what is you doing here? Sergeant Major Saab, I'm just making your charpoy all smooth and silky so you can have dirty big kip, isn't it? If he wants a job, get them boots polished. Sergeant Saab. No nails in air bearer, eh? <laughs> no mm. nails, Sergeant Major Saab. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her! 
Not looking, Sam, just cleaning booties. Do that outside, because I am going to have 40 winks. Just that. <sighs> right, good and daisy. Ciao! <laughs> Left hand! Quick knock! Jeff, stand at ears. Now, what's it all about? Oh, well, sir, it's like this. Uh, Gunner Bowman they and are going to give a show, sir. Charge for hat mission and put the money in their own pockets. And now, sir, you have heard it out of their own mouth. <laughs> uh, well, sir, it's not quite like that. We was going to use the money to buy things to improve the show. I need a, a Carmen Miranda hat. Uh, the fruit's gone bad. <laughs> it's irregular, sir, and entirely against debt will stand in orders. There's no checking they won't spend it on egg banjos. All right, well, I'll look into this one and let you have my decision later. Thank you very much, sir. Show right me a quick march! <laughs> Emily Crichton Dunn Howard? Yes, do you know her? Yes. She came out at the same time as my wife. Really? Yes. I met her at Lavinia Scott Montefiore's dance. Did you? Yes. <laughs> She's a real goer. Who? Lavinia Scott Montefiore? No, Emily Crichton Dunn Howard. Ah. We, uh... We had a bit of a thing. You didn't. We both took our meringues into the conservatory. Miss Anne Miss Harbert, bum with your son of a Get out. Excuse me, sir. I did not wish to interrupt anything important. But it has come to my attention, sir, that Bombardier Solomons and Gunner Bowman is actually a scheme which I think you should nip in a bud before you go, sir. And with your permission, I'd like to wheel them in. All right, Sergeant Major, but remember, we haven't got a lot of time. Stop. Right, good, and daisy. Show! <laughs> Left hand! Quick knock! Left hand, left hand, left hand, left hand, right wheel! All right, Jeff, stand at ease. Now, what's it all about? Oh, well, sir, it's like this. Uh, Gunner Bowman... They are going to gonna give a show, sir. Charge for hat mission and put the money in their own pockets. And now, sir, you have heard it out of their own mouth. <laughs> uh, well, sir, it's not quite like that. We was going to use the money to buy things to improve the show. I need a, a Carmen Miranda hat. Uh, the fruit's gone bad. It's because of the mouse and some very hard short hairs from certain part of Water Buffalo. <laughs> Randy, you're a genius. Oh, sir, you are most kind and quite right. Hey, Mum, Thulki, Dad. Show sure, Matka, big head. <laughs> Go back and pull your punker. <laughs> Randy, Randy, get down the bazaar and get some egg down, Mallum. Well, right, We've got to get that powder in the Sergeant Major's charpoy before he gets his head down this afternoon. <laughs> And laughter to help you on your way. So raising the rafters with a hey, 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 with songs and sketches and jokes old and new. With us about, you won't feel blue. So meet the gang, cause the boys are here. The boys to entertain you. B O B O Y S, boys to entertain you. <laughs> Hey, oh, shut up straight when you're bunkering. And you, stop your damn wailing. And make room for me to park my backside. <laughs> I have to wait here to carry these most important bags for Colonel Sap. <coughs> what you're doing, huh? I'm making chapati for my dinner. Hmm? My friend, you don't mind my telling you. But you are hitting your chapati much too hard. It will be tough, like the rubber tire of Colonel's GP. Randy, <laughs> go and tell to your grandmother how to suck the eggs. Here, try. To be thrown a layer. Isn't that beautiful? Well, it is certainly different. <laughs> now I am understanding why you have such fine teeth. Uh, what are you doing with uh, Colonel's bags? I am putting them in GP because Colonel Saab and Captain Saab are going to Bombay where they are going to stay in beautiful Taj Mahal Hotel. And when they get there, they are going to be drinking the cocktail. 
they drink the cocktails? <laughs> oh, yes. This is very holy ceremony among British officers' hearts. And they are slapping each other on back. And they are chanting, skin of your nose, <laughs> mud in your eye, your bottoms up. <laughs> then they drink the cocktails. Huh? Then they drink the cocktail. Then one very important shouting man is hitting table with hammer. And he is saying, my lord, lady, gentleman, we are standing. And they are all upstanding together. Om Namah Shivaya Parinam. Oh, dearie me, here come the trouble. Oh, that is not trouble, you ignorant coolie. That is Sadhu. He is holy man. He has come to do prayers and to make blessing. Arre, nahi, nahi. Gripo ki jebe khali karne ke liye. Bagal mein churi mo mein ram ram. Goody goody gum drops. Ram tera bala kare beta. Oh, dearie me, he is wanting the lali. Do you think we should be giving him any? Oh, yes, my friend, we must, we must, in case he curses us. This is what we British call the insurance policy. <laughs> you know, I was bearer to Saab once who was cursed. And he was very sicky. And he could not attend the cocktail.